61 years ago, 27-year-old Henry Gustav Molaison had a portion of his brain surgically removed in hopes that it would mitigate his epileptic seizures. His seizures vanished, but so did his ability to retain memories. Because of this, he spent the next 55 years as HM, the anonymous case study for worldwide research on memory and amnesia. Scientists discovered his excised brain part, the hippocampus, was responsible for declarative memory, that which is consciously learned and later retrieved. The post-surgical HM recalled general aspects of his life and could learn new skills, but was incapable of remembering anything he just experienced. After his death, HM's brain was preserved for future investigation, even though the missing hippocampus and the insight it could have offered was long gone. That is, until researchers recently used magnetic resonance imaging to discover vestiges of the removed segment. Along with a vast trove of knowledge about the complexity of memory learned from HM while alive, this new discovery will help add even more dimension to the study of memory and possibly brain-related conditions like Mr. Molaison's epilepsy.